Morning guys, uh, Tony Inley here, uh, you know, sitting on top of uh, Table Mountain and absolutely enjoying the start of an uh, incredible spring. And, uh, you know, training's going strong for the four-way Robin Island that's coming up for the Tableview Neighborhood Watch. And uh, just to, to give you a little bit of motivation out there going into the, into the season, you know, a lot of friends ask me, I say, Tony, you're always motivated and, you know, what keeps you motivated? And um, every couple of weeks, I think I'm going to put a, just a video blog out there for the guys that have lost their mojo um, in, in life. And at the end of the day, you're not too, too old to have a dream and challenge yourself. And basically what gets me up in the morning is you've got two choices in life. You can either be motivated uh, or not motivated. You've got two choices. So I choose to be motivated. Every single day I wake up and, I, and I've got a couple of things that really push, pushes me and drives me. I'm just Tony Enley from Tableview um, and just pushing my own boundaries and you know it, it's, it's never too late to have a dream. So um, I'm going to give you a couple of tips that helps me get up in the morning. So the first thing that you, you know to keep motivated you need to have a goal and a passion and a purpose and on you know what you're wanting to do without any goals um, you're not going to have any real rhythm and you're going to feel that you're in a rat race. So this summer set yourself a goal, it doesn't matter how small it is or what you're wanting to achieve but set that goal and stick to it, um, don't give up and just follow through and once, you, once you've done that goal I promise you that bug will bite and you will set more goals and it will push you through the other levels. Live life fearlessly, uh, you know you only live once uh, you don't want to wake up when you're 90 years old and think that, geez, I, could, I should have lived life, I should have done more. You need to live every day like it's your last. If you, if you have that sort of, um, you know, motivation, like today is your last day, you're going to do a lot more, you're going to enjoy life a lot more, you're not going to let the crappy things like, a, you know, someone driving and hooting at you get you all up flustered. Look past it, have fun and, you know, live life like it's your last. One of the other very important aspects that I've learned so over the last uh, two, three years is time. It's one of the biggest fundamental things that we don't have enough of is time. And I hear a lot of people will say, oh, I don't have enough time to do that. And I challenge you to, to get up a little bit earlier in the morning. Wake up at five o'clock in the morning. Push your limits. And you know at the beginning it's a little bit difficult, but once you get into that zone, getting up an hour, hour and a half earlier every morning, and you analyze your day, do the exercise, do the things that you don't have time to do and uh, it will change your life. A huge fundamental aspect is, is pushing limits. Um, you know, work on your genius. Um, if you're not feeling a little bit of pain or you're feeling not uncomfortable, push your, push your limits a bit that you, you feel uncomfortable because if you're not feeling uncomfortable, you're not pushing yourself hard enough. And once you push your limits, you're just gonna grow as a person and the sky's the limit. Another uh, incredible tip is, you know, when you when you finish your day and, and you just take 15 minutes, if you're a family man, business owner, uh, whatever the case may, might be, at the end of the day, sit back, take 15 minutes and analyze what you did during your day from a, a business um, situation, from a personal situation, from a fitness situation. The great news is once you start analyzing your day and you've missed a couple of elements that you wish that you could do, the great news is tomorrow is a new day. So you can change what you didn't do and you can grow on that. Being surrounded with like-minded people. If you surround yourself with like-minded and positive people, um, you're going to find that you'll go and, and grow as a person as they do. Um, if there's people that are negative, just block them out out your system because life's too short to worry about negative things in life. Look past that um, and, and enjoy life, live it up to its fullest. Yeah, so for me it's, it's really exciting to um, really share what you know, changed my life over the last five years by just setting one small goal and swimming a Robin Island to now challenging myself to a couple of weeks time doing a four-way Robin Island. If you told me a couple of years ago that I'd be doing all these these crazy things, I would say that you're absolutely mad. So I, there's nothing special about me, it's just that I've pushed my mind to push myself out the comfort zone. Never give up hope, never ever ever give up. You're never too old to dream. Anything is possible, you can do it.